Yeah, the big up yourself. Yeah, so today's Sunday. You know, I'm here. I got a bunch of shit to talk about. So we're gonna start this week by talking about first thing, we have a story with Jack Your and Popcorn. Zin? We're gonna talk about that last. Cause that people, first thing we want to remember, I do not speak of anything unless it's in the public space. Meaning some you know all heap of things we are going to people personal life. I do not speak of it or about it until it becomes public information. See? So we're gonna talk about popcorn and jack here last. First thing we're gonna talk about is COVID 19 and the lockdown in a Jamaica. One of that book. Galchester United win only one match on a hype, we still are lead the table here. Yeah. Galchester City are lead the table. Raheem Sterling is still the biggest baller in the whole world. You understand? So you just relax. 90 star boy, big of yourself. So, my thing is, based on what we see, I advertise in the media. See? COVID-19 cases arise in Jamaica rapidly as according to the news. See? But what I say is no. I wish part of Jamaica them do all of them COVID tests there to find out say it's so rapid. Which part? She and Brown 68, 48. Rhyme Sterling have the biggest ball in the world. What I'm saying to you now, where wish part them do the COVID test them to find out that so much cases arise on a daily basis. Where? Now, people of Jamaica, this part sad to say, but you know, so I'm in a sorry phone, no? Here why I'm in a sorry phone, you no? Know? Me telling you, know, before election, say, Andrew Olness has done nothing for me to say he is a good prime minister. He has not done one thing, not even one, for me to say he's a good prime minister. Don't get me wrong, you know. Can he be a good prime minister? Yes. Does he have the potential to be a good prime minister? Yes. Has he done anything to prove to me that he's a good prime minister? No. Well, I'm black that person. People, you more want to do for me too. There's see some people who know something I deal with. Do not tag me in or nothing for them. They won't tell me what they must say about me. None of that. Me don't want to hear. Like, the Hermaphy died. Not tag me in or nothing with the Hermaphy died. Dr. Fish, not tag me in or nothing with him. Zin, Kingfish, not tag me in or nothing with him. I'm not interested to hear. What me I say now is, Andrew Ollis, I rate him as a person. Because he's a good spirit. I me like him talk. But talk is cheap. Talk is cheap. When you are calling the shots for the country, it's beyond talk, you know. Zin, it's about action. And when we say action, we don't mean action for your constituency. We mean action will benefit the entire country. Andrew Olness has not done anything at all, nothing at all, for me commend him as a prime minister who is doing amazing things. I don't see you do nothing. Now, them a lie about the, the, the pike in the COVID-19 cases. They are lying. Because which part all of them tests they go on? Where? Jamaican people, they even take COVID tests. 
much less. If you say you see so much cases that go up every day in a each parish. And I like America, yes, so where every corner you go, every park, them have COVID testing sites with soldiers and police and baby. That's not happening in Jamaica. So obviously the numbers are lie. The number of them are lie. See? Alright. Watch this now. Boom. COVID vaccines them are coming to Jamaica. And then remember the exact number, how much vaccine them say I reach Jamaica at a certain time. Now, them are say people have to take it. Right? Them are say the people them have to take it. But me see a news put out say members of parliament are not um it's not mandatory for the members of parliament take the vaccine so oh you want to give the people them the vaccine but you know want the members of parliament them take the vaccine people now still don't live with that obviously something wrong with the bomb buckle at vaccine No man, yo, Jamaica changed still, you know. I saw me know, say, if you're not born in the 80s right now, you have beat and coward. I be a coward born after the 80s, you know. I want to just sit down, I want to blatantly say them a lie about the COVID numbers, them, and I'm a super vaccine pound, and I'm going to tell them, say, the members of parliament are not subjected to take it. Oh, it go. No, somebody say, I saw it go. Tell me it go then. Because that me seen in the newspaper. Say the members of parliament down there. Them not, them not, them not, them not mandatory to take the vaccine. So why the people them to take it? Because remember, I am from the people, for the people. So I have a reason on behalf of the people. Exactly. Them say them on a priority. Wagwan. Them should have be priority. Are the members of parliament them first to lead by example and publicly take the vaccine in front of the people them and if Andrew Wallace take a vaccine out of that same buckle them he want if Andrew Wallace take a vaccine more want him take him injection from the vaccine in front of me and as them joke him with the needle and give him vaccine the same buckle where him get out of it me want out of nobody bring the next buckle come for me I dust see him buckle there. Can of one buckle them again. And on one buckle them again. Them again about 30 units or 25 units. You know your first dose. I see him exact buckle me want out of. Come then I got trick me and give me a different buckle. That me I tell oh no. That me I try to say. Cause them can give him a injection out of one buckle and then when you go to hospital a different batch of things you get you think I see same thing you get? you think I see the same thing you get? alright Mr. Andrew Olnis since we are Jamaican now if you abide by the rules and the laws and you are do everything America claims to them do the governor of Texas just said Zin me talk too much. Anyway. People, using a brain now, man. When you see the back of the vaccine coming up. I'm sure you want to suck. I don't like it, I talk. You know. Can't take the back of talking. So I want to just love chatter. I want to really um, um, know what I'm going on there. I want to just like talk and counter rock. And say bad things. And we can't show no better than telling you. Know. Me not talk about the same batch. Me want the vaccine out of the same buckle. 
Where Andrew will need to get out of. See back there, man. See back there, man. I saw back of them stay. You know how long this take for done? You know how long this take for done? You know how much unit a liquid in this? You know how much liquid a unit, how much unit a liquid in this? So if them get Andrew, watch this now. If Andrew comes to Bam and get feed first dosage out of this, enough left in there. Me want out of the same buckle. Me want out of the same buckle. See buckle, yeah? Hard for done. It's it not easy for done. Alright? Okay. So, what I am saying is, what I am saying is, The vaccine, them tell you plain to. Even the people them were issue the vaccine tell us that the vaccine don't get rid of COVID. It doesn't. So I'm see the purpose of the vaccine. Anyway, what I say is, Andrew, me not have a problem with the vaccine, but me have to get out of the same buckle where you are get out. See? As they, they put the needle, me have to see the needle. Because people get to them, I don't know. They have some needle. When you push it on your skin, the needle got up back into the syringe. Where they use using the movies and them something. I eat them, I use them. I see them, I put some, some world leader and I go and let them take vaccine. They take a vaccine, yeah? Yeah. So watch this now. If Andrew Olness, I take the vaccine, Zine, I don't have a problem. Me will take the vaccine too. But I want my vaccine out of the same buckle where Andrew will get the vaccine out of. You understand me, I say? Yeah. So, I that me a deal with. If once you give me out of a different buckle, at a different time, at a different place, I don't want it. Me not want it. Me want to out the same buckle. Cause Andrew Wallis cannot done one buckle of the vaccine. You understand? He cannot finish it. So here you are. Share that buckle there with me, Andrew. That me a deal with. See? So basically for me, the vaccine shit a fuckery. Me the business who want to tell the people them say, to take vaccine, and who want to get money, to tell the people them to take vaccine. Cause some people are take pay, if you tell the people about take vaccine, it's good, it's very, very, and not tell about the big fat check where them get. If you tell you that, you understand me? I say, whole heap of illusion are going on. You see me? Yeah, enough, enough illusion. The, the governor of Texas, Zin, just say, him not give a fuck. He might open up Texas. Zin, the governor of Texas straight up say, all businesses are open back. By Wednesday, you wish they didn't choose Wednesday. Gallis Wednesday, they didn't choose. All businesses are open up. There is no mandatory rule for you wearing a mask. There is no restriction you go anywhere you want to go. Let me shed a little light on that now. The governor for Texas is not the president of the United States of America. So, if COVID was that serious, and damaging to the entire United States of America. That governor could not take it upon himself to tell the world from public TV, from national television, say, he might override all protocols of COVID and open up him, him state. They would have shot him, kill him. He would have get charged for treason. He would have get charged for treason. He would have get charged for a go against the rules and laws of the Constitution of the United States of America. You understand what I'm saying? Do you understand what I'm saying? Him, as a governor, couldn't take up that plan for himself and say that. You understand what I'm saying? So them no say COVID-19 
And this vaccine shit is bull fucking shit. You understand what I say? They knew us they are fuckery. One governor could get up and make a decision with the whole country is a god against. You understand? One local governor in a one local state out of the whole 52 state could get up and make a decision there by fit himself. You understand what I say? You can't, and America this. No governor can't just get up and say something where the president and the, the, what they call them, um, carry up a capital hill. What they name? What the people them name up a capital hill? What the fuck are them name, man? Congress. Can't just get up and make decision and if the whole Congress and the president, they must say, yo, at this we are working with you know? Him can't do that. So obviously, him know something where we don't know. You understand? This governor of Texas knows. And then uh, nobody no rebel. Nobody say, oh, this governor must be out of his mind. Oh God, lock him up, Ray Ray, get him out of office. Nobody no say that. Cause them know. You understand? So, Mr. Andrew Olney, sir, if you don't see, sir, this lockdown is destroying Jamaica. I don't know what else we need for Seti and a brother. Because you know what I say now. You hear me interview them, you hear me live them, you know what I say. The only thing the lockdown I do for Jamaica is allowing the criminals to catch who they want to catch. Like sitting ducks. You understand what I'm saying? The only thing the lockdown in Jamaica is doing is allowing these criminals to have free movement, less traffic on road, less eyewitnesses, less everything. You know, I'm not going to have that stupid conversation here with them people. Somebody got to say, foot are you wrong. Each governor governs each state. So you feel like the governor don't have a boss? Why would the most reasons are illiterate? You don't think these governors are selected and appointed into power by somebody? Sometime before you type, you not think. So you think because you're a governor of state, you can just get up and do anything when you want to do in a state, brother? You're an idiot, man. You don't have sense, no, man. And we could have sensible conversation, man. Anyway, what I say is, in Jamaica, this lockdown thing is allowing criminals to mobilize them criminal activity more peacefully, more quickly, more fluent, fluently, with less eyes and ears. You understand? So when a man comes to Obama and say, all right, we are drive a few miles go up the road, go fire some shot. Because of the lockdown, most people in the yard, most care over the road, road clear. Obviously, 90% of the time, who the gunman I go look for, they are in the yard. There's not enough police to police everybody there they may have in every community. So a man know say you are easy walking in a park. For 10, 12 away or 5, 6 away. Just go up there and surround the house and murder we are murder and cut and we are get to the traffic not upon the road. Nobody not see a license plate. Not like that. So the criminal them love the COVID. They love the lockdown. You understand what I say? You understand? Next thing, I don't understand where Andrew are dealing. Andrew said, it's alright for wedding go on, but it's not alright for funeral keep. See? This to me is one of the most inconsiderate 
non-sensitive decision me could have hear because me could do the maths if a man and a woman are get married and because of the lockdown them can't postpone them wedding you know them can't have the wedding at a later date you know them done engaged already oh you got to tell people to keep them dead until whatever time you get remember every day you know, the mag have more money you know every day the mag all the body you know and more money you know so all them people you got to keep them dead so long plus them now work plus the country locked down the hustling now go on the funeral most important make the funeral them keep Many people then bury them dead and they say, oh, three family members alone to a funeral. Our immediate family alone. And make the people then respectfully bury them dead. The fuck you me? Oh, sorry. Because I'm talk about that. The Prime Minister, I can't be disrespectful. Because I still have respect for um Hold on, let me hear what this. I'm pin that comment there, hold on. Um, the comment there says, uh, my friend's mom passed away from January and he can't get out till April. So imagine she's been on ice. She's been on ice. He's mad. He's booked his ticket and he was meant to go out the 1st of March and he's not going till April. What day did you give me until April? What day? Did you give me sometime in April? Can't remember, but they cancelled. Is March 1 for the first? Kind of not right, good, but I'm just saying. You know? Why would you, why would you give the privilege to get married, but take away the opportunity of burying the dead? I don't understand how that works. I don't understand that, how that works. People, if 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 me attack rubbish, you can type the word rubbish. You, know. when you can say footer, you attack rubbish. You know. If a fool is coming, just a think. How inconsiderate can you be? A dead, the dead smart is not come back. They can't come back. And it will get worse and worse. The longer you keep the dead, are the worse. You understand? Or you are say it's alright for it and go on. But funeral, nothing keep. 